<clears throat> mm. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, I got no I got nothing to say here. <laughs> Or Castlevania. It's kind of a bonus. Well, it's not even a bonus stream. This is the makeup for a stream I missed like a month ago that I kept putting off. It's probably not going to be a, a full three hour stream either. It's probably going to be like close to it, like two hours and 30, 2.45. But I don't know. I, we'll see. Well, wherever I am at that point, if I'm in the middle of something, maybe I'll keep it going. Okay, so there ain't nothing we do over there. So last time on Castlevania, uh, Soma went to visit a shrine, ended up in a castle inside an eclipse, uh, his girlfriend is with him, who was his childhood friend even though he's an exchange student in the English version of the game. Um, he meets a bunch of people, a guy named Genya Arikado, who's definitely not Alucard in a suit, uh, Yoko, who's some lady who's exploring this place, a guy named Jay, who doesn't have any memory of his life. And, uh, Graham, who is apparently not a good guy, according to the mysterious lady. Also, it's the year 2035, and Dracula is long dead. Unfortunate, because that's going to respawn him now. Yeah, I'm not too big on this weapon. I might replace it. Swing weapons are cool, but... They are kind of, uh... They do kind of lack the forward coverage. from in here. Get over here. Let me poke you. Yeah. So, my last streams were Tuesday and Wednesday? Yeah, Tuesday I did Mario, and then today I did, uh, and Wednesday I did Castlevania. I skipped yesterday because I just wasn't really in the mood. And I figured, you know, I've got at least another two days this week that I can stream, so I'll do it one of the other days. Oh, I also have the whip sword, I gotta remember that. So yeah, just uh decided to take two days for a day. 
after this week, I'm gonna go back to two a week, which, I mean, that's what I was doing before, so... Okay, so yeah, the way this works is that once you exit that four square area in the middle, you end up in these weird rooms just floating here at the top. They don't really... Ex there's no explanation as to why, but that's just how it is. Devil. Oof. I'm gonna need to get his soul. Something interesting about this game, they don't, uh... If, if there's, like, a certain amount of pixels above your character's head, they actually just won't let you jump. It's like, here I could do a jump and hit the ceiling, but here if I tap the A button, someone just stand still. They actually, like, programmed, like, a minimum jump requirement for him. Just for that extra little bit of realism, it's like, oh, well, he wouldn't jump and just knock his head against nothing. Okay, so this sent me over here. I don't believe there's any trick to the doors, it's just that they all send you to, like... They, they, they're not connected sequentially. Ooh, gotta stand back from that. I believe that thing can just scream and destroy you. Obviously, exaggerating. Not outright destroy you, but... Ooh. So yeah, backdashing in this game, uh, nowhere near as overpowered as it is in Symphony of the Night, where that's the primary movement in a speedrun. It's, it's continuously hitting the backdash. Like, you could, you could mash it, but you need to finish the animation. Ooh, I see a bag of mun. This game has a lot of spots where you just get hit and you fall, like, really far. Got some smackers. Nice. Where am I now? I'm in this weird room. I'm assuming there's a boss room somewhere here. Altair summons and hurls eagles. Ooh, that sounds right up my alley. Neat. Little, little Fleeman. These are smaller than the other Fleeman. Rippers. Stabs enemies with a blood-soaked nice ha knife. Nice. How is that different from uh, the other one? Ripper. And what's the other one? It was Evil Butcher. Five. Wow, Ripper's way more expensive. It's just a, sh a much stronger knife. That said, I'm gonna stick with Altair. Save, so I'm assuming the boss room is down here, is in this area. This is honestly one of my favorite parts of this game, the floating garden. I didn't remember, like, the teleporting gimmick, I just remembered it being- Whoa, what is this?
Well, we ain't going in there. Kick skeleton. Reminds me of, um... Oh, what are those things called? Secretary birds? People refer to them as kick turkeys. Because they're like turkeys, but they kick people. Ow, bitch. Okay. Oh, we're almost at 50%. I don't know how long this game is. I think it'll take me at least one stream after this to complete. But I'm also going to do a, a, a Julius mode run. And then I'll probably move on to... Uh... So I, I assume Julius mode will take me at least a stream, if not more. And then this will take at least one more. So this will probably be like a four stream game. And then that'll be... That'll be like the middle of October, and then I'll just move on to Parasite Eve 2. And that'll probably be the rest of the month, honestly. I don't really have anything planned for October, for Halloween itself. It's just like, what if, if I still have spooky game, then I'll stream something. I don't know. I don't see myself wearing that mask again, because that thing smells. And I can't get used to wearing it. Okay, I'm in the room that I was in before. There's just there's a, two rooms here that I haven't gone to yet. Interesting. Yeah, I backed out of this room because of the werewolf. They intimidated me. That's a regular golem. I fought a wood golem before. Berserked. Shit. So those blue imps, if they possess you, you just stand still and attack wildly. Alright, so I've been through everything, but I haven't um, gotten to that one room on the right yet. Or that one room in the middle. I feel like there's a trick here that I'm not getting yet. Maybe if I go from the left, things will be different. with the, uh, a, sp a spinning weapon. Or, or swing weapon. Oh, swing weapon, excuse me. They got lots of power. I'm in here. Okay, so there is a door where... It... So there is a, a door with, like, weird fuckery going on here. Oh, God. I'm... Just a bunch of werewolves.
I feel like this room's important, though, because you have to get in here a special way. like a transitional room. Clock tower. Ooh. Staple of Castlevania. No, I want that heart. So, we meet again. I'm glad to see you're unscathed. Good to see you too. Uh, I've got something I want to ask you. Sure, go ahead. Someone told me that you are to inherit Dracula's powers. I take it that lady from the church told you that, didn't she? It's not true, is it? The term inherit is co incorrect. It's true then. I was born on the very day that Dracula was destroyed. So, in short, that means that I am Dracula. Yeah, that logic makes perfect sense. That can't be right. You've been so kind and friendly to me. That is because I don't consider you a threat to my mission. But that being said, you have made it this far. I sense a power within you. Do tell me, what kind of power has awoken within you? The... power to rule. What? You foolish boy! That's impossible! Huh? I can't remain here any longer. I must get to the throne. Your name is Soma, right? You are wrong, Soma. I will not allow you to rule. And he runs off like a pansy. Jeez, what was that all about? What's in those rooms up there that I missed? Well, I can't go into them anyway, so it doesn't matter. Oh, this area is directly connected to that. Cool. Oof. Ow! Oh god, there's gold in there too. How did I not see that? Probably should stock up on potions when the health prick when I get the chance. Yeah, this is probably a better weapon. One less attack, but it poisons and has better reach. Honestly, if it wasn't for the floating garden this would, and the entry hall, this would probably be one of the best clock tower games in the series. Well, I mean, it is, but it'd be one of my favorite songs in this game if it wasn't for the uh, entry hall and the floating garden. Hello, so oh, that was a really cheery hello. Hello, Soma. Hey, Yoko. I just ran into Graham. Really? Which way did he go? He was in a rush to get to the throne. He actually came by this way because this is the only path in the clock tower. Just as I thought, there's something important in the throne room. I'm sorry, Yoko. What? What's wrong with you all of a sudden? He's not who I thought he was. He was kind to me only because he thought I was powerless. I see. 
but his attitude changed suddenly when I told him about my power. Well, in his mind, he thinks everything in this castle is his. So that's the reason. But it's better this way. What is? The fact that he sees you as an enemy now means you're my comrade. Does it? What? You don't want to be on my side? No, that's not what I meant. <laughs> it's so much fun to tease you. But this is not the time to be fooling around. Your presence here has thrown Graham into a panic. This is our chance. What sort of chance? Using his cunning mind, he's been able to evade his... Using his cunning mind, he's been able to evade us up, to, up until now. Blech. I don't think anyone has ever seen him panic before. I get it. Circumstances right now are making him act this way. That's exactly right. This is an excellent opportunity to trap him. Well, I must be on my way. See you. I mean, if he wants his castle, he can have it. So I can't fall. I need something to actually let me swim. Because the only other thing I could do is stand on the water. With Undyne, or Undini, or however it's pronounced. It's pronounced Undyne. It's, it's... I'm In Tales of Symphonia for GameCube, they refer to her as Undini, or Undini, which is really weird. And that's how I thought it was pronounced for a very long time. Just like I thought the word Valkyrie was Valkyrie. But I was proven wrong on both accounts. Speaking of water, I need a sip. My mouth's getting dry. By the way, when I say sip, I mean like three gulps. I, I, gu I, I guzzle water. I don't sip it. I actually don't really like the taste of water. And I know people are like, oh, it doesn't have a taste. It does. I'm not big on it. Though I've gotten more used to it ever since I started, uh pursuing voice acting, because I've just kind of had a bottle of it on hand at all times. Uh, a safe way to stand there. Oh, fuck. Can't believe I've done this. Yeah, it's definitely worth taking the one attack. Uh, the one point like, debuff in order to have that reach. I mean, the, the downside is I don't have the overhead swing anymore, but... I mean, fighting an enemy directly above you in this game is kind of rare. Also, the game's nice enough to let you walk off a ledge with a spike at the edge of it and not get hurt. very particular about what you can uh, ground slide off of. Ow. This would be worse if these were the yellow uh, Medusa heads. Gremlin. Luck is increased by 8. Ooh, that'll help me get more um, souls. I think. Let me see, actually.
Uh, actually, it doesn't really matter. They said the luck, the luck rate does not matter that much at all. <laughs> I'm probably better just using. Ooh. Oh, I should see what um. Let's see. Headhunter. Uh, it's still a one point buff to defense, but I'm getting three intelligence, three con. But I'm losing five strength and attack. Well, strength slash attack. Again, there's a direct correlation between attack and strength, so. I wonder why there's um like a slide pad there. Oh, there are the yellow Medusa heads. Yeah, the yellow Medusa heads will turn you to stone if they hit you. Not fun. Especially in an area with a bunch of moving platforms. If you missed last stream, the reason I swing at uh, walls is to uh, see if I could find any hidden passageways. Because they are all over this castle. fight. Yep. No dialogue, though, in this game. Very interesting, because death is usually a talkative motherfucker in these games. I guess Dracula's death has left him a shadow of his former self. I mean, I, I'm, I'm almost... In fact, I think that's almost a literal thing because uh, his physical body isn't here. Just his axe, his scythe. Oh, never mind. There he is. We got... Going to the bone zone now. of iframes in this game is ridiculous. I tried air dodging. thought this was Hollow Knight for a second. Fuck. That was my first game over. Use a lot of potions there. Oh, that's a New Game Plus thing. I'm like, why? What is that thing? That What is the point of the arrow? Or the bat? 
Provides protective barrier, repels bolts with shields. Those both are blocking projectiles. Can increase my defense by four. That's not really going to make a difference, though. so bad if things didn't spawn right on top of you. time to uh, equip something a little longer ranged. Oh my god. Yeah, this is where the difficulty starts ramping up a little bit. Like, there's no way to avoid that. That ain't it. Oh, he does not go... Like he's, he acts like he's gonna go backwards, and then he stops, like, immediately. He always stops short. Here we go. Katana's actually coming in handy here. Got a pretty disjointed hitbox. Oh my god. I wish it didn't apply both ways, though. Got him. Ow! Fucker. Death attacks using sickles. Neat. I don't think that's a set drop, either. I got lucky there. Is he not? Death. Oh, he's an L button. Or he's an R button. Oh, as long as you press the R button once, it's like a toggle. Oh, that's cool. I like that. I'm gonna keep that on unless I need something else. Put the haunting back on. I could probably get rid of the these three next time I go back. Do I have a better... Not really. Eerie looking necklace. One defense minus one luck. Yeah, we'll put that on. Just gotta remember not to sell what I have equipped because this game does not protect you for that. Allows you to walk while underwater. Skula. Okay, cool. So now I can actually go underwater. Very odd thing for death to give out. Oh, look at that. Wow, that's so good. S saving automatically deactivates it.
transitional area. Where are we now? Top floor again. I think this is the area that we were in for like a minute before and we couldn't get through. Yeah, it is. I remember this music. Ah, oh, but you can't go any further here. There's a shortcut out. Interesting that you could go to this area from two separate other areas, but both times you get locked out either way. So it's kind of just like a tease. That's probably the final area. I can't remember. My damage like skyrocket at that battle. Ooh, Harpy shoots out razor like feathers. Goes left and right. Eh, that's not too bad. damage that armor with that weapon. So the uh, soul to go underwater is a yes, Skula. I should walk while underwater. Liking those Baphomet statues back there. Those are pretty cool. I feel like there's something here. Tell what oh, there's a room above me, so oh no, I don't know if Spike's damage gets uh gets increased when you're stoned, but I'd rather not find out. Needles. Tosses mines into the air that explode at fixed intervals. Oh, these both, uh, go every which way.
Ow. Okay. Let me back up a little bit. Uh, wow, this area's a lot bigger than I thought it would be. Steel plate. Wait, what? Breastplate forged from steel. Raises my defense quite a bit, but lowers my strength and con by two. Hmm. Ah, uh, you know what? I'd say that's worth the defense drop. Or it's worth the attack drop, just because... That's, uh... That, that defense boost is pretty beefy. Whatever's down here better be worth it. Black suit. Black suit is dark as the night sky. Ooh, it's a direct upgrade to the steel plate. Neat. Worth the diversion. Especially since the steel the steel suit was completely unintentional. right here is going to take us down to the bottom, probably. Oh, that's just what we need. That's just what we need. Though, to be fair, you could damage buffer off the uh, Medusa heads. Because touching those spikes probably way worse than getting hit by a Medusa head. Dead end too. Burt Gang. Mystical Sword of Protection. Whoa! Gives me con and look at that attack buff right there. That's ridiculous. Even my strongest weapon is like way weaker than that. It's got the same general range as the Hurunting as well. That's pretty good. It's doing almost 100 damage. Beefy boy here.
Ow. Lightning doll. Discharges lightning from fingertips. Ooh, that sounds cool. 46 MP per use. Oh, yeah. That is my jam right there. Lightning everything. Oh, good. A warp area. Take the warp area back down. Uh, or back there. Wait. Oh, well, too late. I fell anyway. Also, I gotta remember that I have this ability. we go now? We could go to the right, and we could go downwards. It's from the left. Still can't get up to that area over there. That should grade out. Any of those grayed out areas on the map, I actually can't get to yet still. What are we at? 60%. Not bad. I keep trying to add, think, I keep thinking I'm gonna activate the, uh, the floating thing. I keep forgetting I don't have it equipped. Got for hammer. Uh, do you know something something about Arikado? Yeah, sort of. Is that weird fellow a friend of yours too? You're more popular than I thought. Don't much like people like that. So what can I sell you? Okay. I gotta make sure I don't sell what I have equipped. Grunting I don't need anymore. 
baton I'm gonna hold on to. Rapier we don't need. Got two of those. We don't need the cut all. We do not need the lance. I don't need the cloth tunics. I didn't even know I had those. Don't need them. Don't need them. Don't need them. That's what I'm wearing. Don't need it. 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 Keeping that. Okay, good. We keep the whip sword as well. Why can you buy more than one of these? Oh, he sells high potions now. Fuck. Base Lord Combat Knife. He probably doesn't sell anything better than what I have already. Oh, Ashalon. Famous Sword of the Dragon Slayers. I'm gonna lose the defense buff from the other weapon, but I get another 50 attack. Holy hell. Soul Eater Ring increases the appearance of appearance rate of spirits. 300,000 gold. Jesus. That's, I mean, that's a pretty good item, but still. Blood Red Cloak. That's just flat out better than what I have. That's probably an accessory. I probably shouldn't bite on this, but I will. I'm gonna get the Ascalon. Or the Ascalon. Plate of pure gold. I don't even have enough for that. That defense bust buffs boot boost isn't really worth it. No, hammer, shut up. It's another overhead weapon. Very powerful, but hmm. Well, we'll hold on to it. We can sell the skull necklace now. Sells for 333, which means it's buying price is 666. <laughs> Why is pressing B? Activate them. Okay. Welcome back. Hey, Mina. What's up? It's kind of late to ask, but what kind of shrine is the Hakuba Shrine? Soma, do you know the story of the Amona Wa Amo Amanoi Wado Shrine? I think I've heard it before. In the story, Tensho Daijin hides herself in the shrine to calm Susano down. Yeah, I remember now. Tensho Daijin is the sun. The act of hiding symbolizes an eclipse. By hiding herself away, she was able to contain Susanoo's anger. For that reason, eclipses are thought to confine anger and evil intentions. Yes, people have prayed to eclipses for centuries. And the Hakaba Shrine is a shrine for this very purpose. I understand now. And usually we only conduct ceremonies for Japan's eclipses, but... In 1999, a ritual was conducted in Europe. Yes, that's what I was told. And that's when Dracula's castle was sealed inside it. That's why I knew that... That's why I knew the things that Mr. Arikado said were... Yes, I know that he spoke the truth. I'm sorry. I haven't been much help to you. That's not true. I feel a bit relieved now. Thanks, Mina. Welcome back. How are you all? Oh, yeah, it's the same dialogue as before. I don't think I could do anything up there yet, still. Nah, I need the ability to go through grates. Oh, there's something over to the left, though. I didn't notice that.
Or not. Never mind. Yeah, that's good damage. Alright, so where to next? Uh, forward, then down. There's two ways I can go there. Because I have the soul that goes that could go to either one of them. Ooh, I kind of, like, stop when I hit the ground with this weapon. I wonder if that's intentional. Honestly, while I'm here, I might as well be using the... Oh, I should sell the katana. Why do I still have that? I should keep the Burke thing on, though, just because it's quicker. Oh, that just leads to the garden. Okay, so I was already in there. And that is sink rock. Okay, so we're in the underwater area again. Loops around. Bagomun. Summons Imp the Familiar. Milliken sword. And turn enemies to stone. It's kind of the same, except it has the stone ability on it. Well, that's neat, I guess. Top of that thing. Whoa, whoa. Is that thing called a flesh golem? Holy shit. That's gross.
It tells me I'm gonna need the, uh, the flying armor to stay on for a while. Archdemon. Ooh. weird. I was poisoned, but nothing really seemed to happen to me. This room's flashing. It's supposed to be like a crystal glistening, I guess. Who's dootin'? You're dootin'. two yet. First spirit is a demon from Hellfires. The third spirit is a beautiful nightmare. So I need ancient book two. some punishment. big. I don't like the illusion of choice. Oh, uh, can I actually- Oh, you could just jump into the underwater. Makes sense, because I guess you could just otherwise have the soul that lets you swim, or not just take the soul off that lets you sink. When motionless HP are gradually restored. Hey! Pretty good. Dead for a little break. Ugh. 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 That's a pretty decent rate of refilling, too. Let's see what's going on in my mail for a minute. 
The answer is absolutely nothing. It's a very quiet night tonight. That's enough of that. Ooh, more goodies. Rune Ring. Increases the rate at which MP is restored. Oh, that goes great with that soul I just got. That's worth a point dip in intelligence and defense, too. Why would there be a dead end? This is a Castlevania game. There's no such thing as dead ends. Osafune. Sword with a very long blade. It's not as strong as the Berg... The Berk Gang. Oh, it's an overhead, but it's very big. Also, it's a little faster than the other ones. So that's probably a direct upgrade of the... Well, I don't even have... I have the Ashalon instead. I could definitely see that range helping out, though. Fish Head shoots fireballs. Yeah, but I got lightning hands. I mean, who wouldn't want that? Bucks. It's not bad. dead end? What? Why? What? Why? Why bother? I love how Soma just has an innate ability to float up waterfalls because it's technically a water surface. It's a good thing I went over here first, since this is just a complete dead end. Game. I didn't. I, I said this in the last stream. I'm not a big fan of the guns. 
in the Sorrow games. They're not very good to use. At least the ones in Dawn of Sorrow aren't. I don't know if the one in this game is any different. So it seems I'd have to come up through the bottom to get that. I think I might make a retreat here, just so, uh, just to not risk it, because I'm running a little low on health, and I don't want to blow all my potions. Plus, the enemies back here are weak enough that they won't hurt me. Yeah, they're all doing one damage. as well. I really don't like how that sword, like, if I jump slash, it doesn't hit when I hit the ground. Either that or I keep hitting the bones that the skeletons are throwing and it's like erasing the hitbox. I'm not going for that 300,000 ring. Fuck that. Yeah, no. I, I ain't going for that shit. There, I should just have the whip sword, the bird tang, and the ashalon. Perfect. Pitch black suit and the rune ring. Skula on, because we need that. Flying armor will keep on. Lightning doll will keep on. Good. Okay, we're ready to go. And I immediately get a useless cloth tunic. And another one.
keep forgetting I could do that. Kind of hurt a little bit. All right, now I think we just ride this straight forward. Do a little JoJo pose there, which is intentional, by the way. This series is full of subtle JoJo references. Speaking of which, uh, the Part 5 anime started today, and uh, it was pretty good. I'm definitely looking forward to seeing where it goes, and I'm looking forward to seeing what happens when they eventually dub it, because I am a big fan of uh, anime dubs. I know it's like sacrilege, but, you know... And they, they, fans like that do exist. That'll probably be way off, though. They're still in the middle of part four in America. Okay, I think I need Undyne for this. It's actually a long-standing thing that, uh, I, I believe Igarashi is a big fan of, uh, JoJo. And he's thrown in a couple references here and there, like the poses that some characters make in some games. Uh, I know Jonathan in Portrait of Ruin makes a couple of very similar poses. Also, there's the stone mask in Symphony of the Night. just yet because I feel like that's where I'm supposed to go because that leads to that big room from before. Oh, okay. You're so good, huh? Eat that shit. Take back what I said, there are some dead ends in Castlevania, and they're usually frustrating because there's enemies in them. This room is, uh, this room's pretty beefy, too. It's a beefy boy.
There's nothing down here. Okay. I thought there was a path here, but... I guess this is more of a straightforward room than I thought. Ooh. A super potion. More needles, really. Okay, now we're down here. There's a path up here that I haven't gone through yet. I don't know if I can reach it, though. Oh, I can, because I got undone now. Oh, it's a lot of mermen. Elfin robe. Clothing woven woven by an elf. Lowers my defense by six, raises my intelligence by seven. Pretty good, but I don't think I'd want the intelligence drop or the uh, defense drop. Why do I do that? Why do I always do that? I say the wrong thing. Creepy. Oh god, man eater. Shoots a ripple laser. What? Okay, I gotta check that shit out like immediately. 22 per use. Oh, it shoots out the little nuclear Cheerio from uh. From Metroid. Well, oh, that's that's unfortunate. That was such a like a huge enemy too. I thought that was gonna be something really neat. Ooh, look at dead end. And a weapon. Rahab sword. Enchanted sword of ice. Also looks like an over. Oh no, it's a swingy sword. Okay, cool. And I think that's stronger than the um the Burt Gang. Though that also raises my defense a bit. So I take a two two point dip in defense and con, but I get a plus two attack. Plus I get ice element. Not gonna lie, that is pretty cool. Part of me also feels like the defense is more important, so I'm probably just going to stick with the Burt Gang. So I could go down or I could go to the right. Let's go down. This room is very familiar. In fact, this is pretty much just a recolor of, uh... First, fuck. Oh, there goes my MP. This room is pretty much just a recolor of that one room from uh, Symphony of the Night. No, don't you dare. Ukobak. Oh, 
Kagi Nazo. I'll go to save point. There's something here. This room has definitely got something, something sus going on in it. Or not. Maybe it was just my imagination. Punches enemies. Ooh. Wait, what? Oh, it's a. S Wait, what? How? Oh my god! It's literally a stand. I told you this game was full of JoJo. It even makes the fucking aura aura. I don't. Oh, that's so cool. Well, I know what I'm keeping on. Just when I was like, eh, maybe it's a stretch. Nope, there we go. There's the direct reference right there. Oh, I can't crouch, though. That sucks. Oh, it's also an enemy right on top of me. Yo, why is this enemy not dying? Okay. Just got another merman, I think. I love how this thing's using like no MP either. I could just keep it on for like so long. Mana Prism. Prism. What does that do? That's probably a full... F restores all of your MP. Okay. Ow! Oh god, that actually hurts you no matter where you are. The Mandragora. Slime. Throw slime balls at enemies. That sounds fun. Oh, these guys just throw them. Oh god, isn't this the boss from before?
Oh good, perfect. Bomber armor. Bomber armor. Astounding amount of destruction. Destructive. Wow. Why can't I read that? Bomber armor. An astounding amount of destructive power. There we go. go this way before? Did I just opt to not go this way? Yeah, it seems like it. Oh, because then I went to the right, the left, fully. I feel like there's something down below me that I didn't get, like in that space. In the circle I just made. Alright, so to the right it is. Slime up. Alright, uh, would I just get bomber armor? 80. Hmm. I gotta be honest, does not seem that impressive. Oh, fuck. What the hell does poison even do? Does it make you lose HP? I mean, that is pretty powerful, considering I'm only doing 130-something uh, damage. But, uh, I gotta admit, the Lightning Doll is just way cooler. Let me hit that save point again. It was just a dead end. I feel like there's something I could do in here that I'm not doing. Ow. Well, whatever. Uh, so let's back down to the right then. like my favorite setup now. Fucking stand and force lightning. 
I could finally live out both my weeb and my Star Wars nerd dreams. Hold on one second. Alright. Where am I? What the fuck was that? Is that from the golem or something else? I think it is. Oh, Alright, getting past this thing is going to be a pain. Level on my 28. I think somewhere in the 40s is where the game is ex usually ends. That's only if you're not really going for a hundred percent. Oh, I think you just take more damage when you're poisoned. Definitely wasn't taking 44 damage before from the slimes. Oh good, back to this shit. Retreat here is for the best. water. I'm pretty sure uh, Hammer actually sells that. One defense minus three. Strong against water attributed attacks. Uh, I'll hold on to it, but I don't think that's going to be too useful. Weird flash. I think that's an enemy, and I probably need some special thing to uh, see it. Oh my God, the sword's range is not very good. Strength is increased by 16. Yow, dude. I was using Minotaur before. This is even better. Yeah, look at that. <gasps> Holy shit. I don't remember this part. Damn, I hate to be interrupted. Yoko! 
Are you alright? If you're okay, say something. Anything. I'm... I'm alright. Thank you... for rescuing me. Graham, that bastard. What has he done? He has... absorbed this castle's power. And he's gotten much stronger. Ow, uh, my plan... it has... failed. Save your strength. There's no need to speak. Be... cautious of him. But to don't... overexert... yourself. What? Yoko! Oh, she's just unconscious. She's still breathing. I mean, yeah, getting stabbed to the stomach. You know, that doesn't kill you. I underestimated the amount of power he acquired. Don't just stand there mumbling. Yoko's in bad shape. Go. I will see to her wounds. I can't just leave her like this. She's my friend. You met her like two hours ago. Do not worry about her. I believe there are other things you need to do. Graham went to the throne. What's there? What are you hiding from me? I cannot say. You must go there yourself. And if you don't, you will lose Mina and Joko as well. Their fate is in your hands. Damn you. I don't like your attitude, but I don't think you're lying. It feels as if I'm being manipulated. I don't like it, but I'll do as you say. But if we ever escape from this castle alive, I want to know everything. Fair enough. Now be on your way. Tells me going that way is not a smart idea. So one of the left leads to a new area. That's fine. Honestly, I'm kind of concerned about how low my health is here. and jiggles. Neat. Underground cemetery. Oh, this is another area. Fuck. Uh, I don't know if I'm ready for that. over there I missed, but I don't want to go all the way back there right now. The arena. Ooh, don't know if I'm ready for this area either. Whoa! Oh man. Uh, that's bad news. Beam skeleton. was almost a Vinny losing to a Nova Skeleton moment right there. Which I'm pretty sure is the same enemy, they just renamed it in this one. Fifty percent of your MP. I was like one hit away from death there too. If I had not used that potion, the the woman would have killed me.
potato pancake. The burnt edges are the best part. Your dudes will not affect me. Ooh, milk. Yep. I had a feeling. Low fat milk. Ooh, that was pretty good, actually. Just for 200. Con increased by 12. Cool. See, this ga a game like this would have benefited heavily. Oh, good. A warp spot. Um, a game like this would have benefited heavily from, uh, like, the DS's touchscreen and extra buttons. I mean, essentially, that's what Dawn of Sorrow is. It's an upgraded version of this game. But, like, having, like, a quick menu to switch souls would be nice. Then again, Dawn of Sorrow doesn't actually have that. Hey, that woman back there, is she okay? I don't know. She's been wounded pretty badly. The medicine I have won't help much. Hope she'll be alright. Yeah, me too. Know why I say that? Because she's my type. Yeah, that's very thoughtful of you, you know. Hoping that someone's alright just because she's your type. Well, I got a business to run. What would you like? We don't need that. Uh, ditch this. Ditch that as well. I was gonna say, what's increasing my energy here even more? Alright, he's not selling anything else. Oh, Soma. I wonder if Yoko will be alright. Do you know Yoko? Yes, she's been coming to my house since I was very young. Because I'm an only child, she's been like a big sister to me. How come you've never mentioned this before? I see. Did Arikado bring her here? Yes, he did. And I'm sure she's okay. He said not to worry about her. He was confident that he could save her. That's why he brought her here. If you say that she'll be fine, I'll believe you. I know this is tough for you, but hang in there. Okay, leave it to me. Yoko, please don't die. Oh, he says something different. Welcome back. How are you holding up? Lately, I've been feeling strange. I'm so exhausted. Are you sure you'll be okay? I'm sorry I worried you. I'm sure I'll be fine. Waiting here is easy. If you say so, but... I must find an escape route. Quickly. Yeah. Oh, talking to uh, Mina, I think, refills you.
Fuck. Because this room's gotta be such a goddamn clusterfuck. Some fruit dried woman. I believe there is a way to get past here, but I can't remember how. I mean, there obviously is a way to get past here, but... Whatever's in here, I'm not supposed to be here yet. I'm getting some weird... Oh, you know what? I think I know what I need. Because there's an ability, I think, that stops time. And that stops the waterfall. And I believe it could stop that enemy as well. Ooh, leech trick. So, let's see. It's about two hours. I'm gonna go for another, like, half hour or so. Uh, that means I could probably do one more area. I gotta figure out which one I want, though. Do I want to go to the arena, or do I want to go to the cemetery? I probably can only go to one of them. And then the other one's gonna block me out. Jaguar. By Fron. More like by Fron, because he's gone. I think I remember what this is. Yeah, you can't hurt those things in the background. You'll see why in a minute. In a few minutes.
So yeah, all these bodies, uh, they're all piling together into a giant mass of whatever. Yeah, that's the boss. It's Legion. A little bit's hurt, too. This is the time for a mind up. Oh, you can't. This, the middle's a block. Shit. Restores exactly 29 HP. That's weird. But hey, I beat this thing. Legion fires an array of lasers. Eat. Fucking Doc Ock arms. Range is pretty decent. Recognize places in which time has been stopped. Oh, that's actually an ability. Haven't seen one of those in a while. to have killed the demon. It's better than the uh, Bergen Strawberry. Oh, it's just a swingy weapon. Ugh. Hate all the good weapons with the sw overhead swingy weapons. Gold ring. Makes enemies leave behind more money when you wear this ring. Lowers my defense by one. Uh, I don't know. That's not really worth it. I'll hold on to it, though. I feel like there could be more here, but whatever.
79% of the map completed. Okay. That wasn't here before. Allura Une. To the arena it is. Honestly, I don't think that time stop ability comes in handy anywhere near here. I think it's an ability to stop time, but... Hey Ryan, what's up? Can't get to the gray areas. Can't get to either of those areas that are cut off. This really is the only path left. Your cell phone just died and you have to get... You got to have banana bread, batter, ice cream. Oh, you got to have it. Okay. That sounds good, actually. I have banana split ice cream here that I've been using to make shakes, but not really the same thing. Don't get hit by the Nova Skeleton. It does like 80 damage. Okay. Brute Force uh, isn't the way to go with the Blue Nova Skeletons, or Beam Skeletons, sorry. Fires a deadly beam. Ooh. Please tell me that's as good as, as this. 28. Yeah. I. Oh, that does a lot of damage, though. It's a lot less costly than the uh, Legion one. Ramen. Noodles floating in a broth made from pork bones. I have three things of rotten meat. the red stand more. Yeah, I know. Ever since I got it, I haven't taken it off yet. It doesn't do a lot of damage, though, but it costs, like, nothing to keep it out. can't actually sell the rotten meat. That's annoying. What? Taste oh, Tasty Meat restores 290 HP. Oh yeah, the meat strip only restores... Why? That's so weird. Yeah, we don't need that. 
Got more shit to sell me yet? Nah, it doesn't look like it. Honestly, aside from the Soul Eater ring, I don't think he's selling me anything new here. Which I'm- I got a tenth of the amount of money to get. Wait, let me buy supplies, actually. Ah, uh, mind up. Anti-venom. Yeah, alright, well, that's good enough. Oh, you do refill everything talking to her. Cool. This is the one with the zombie soul and the rotten food. Uh, I, I have, have I gotten the zombie soul yet? I'm not sure. I can't imagine I didn't get it. Because I killed so many of them, but probably not. Maybe it is. I don't know. That might be Dawn of Sorrow, though. 80% of the map done. All right, to the left. This might be the final stretch for tonight. I imagine the zombie soul drop rate must be very low because of how many you have to kill here. You played both Ari and Dawn, yeah. I mean, there's a lot of mechanics in both games that work exactly the same, so who knows. I don't even want to bother grinding. It's not really worth it. Skull million. Oh, fuck. Poison? Really? So, poison in this game doesn't damage you, it just makes you take double damage. watched it in like three seasons, so I don't know what the hell's going on there. Fuck! I hate these. I hate this. go up there. Boss room, though. Oh, that's not fun. Holy hell, why are there so many of these? This is 
is a dead end, too. Good. Good for me. Galamath. Oh, this is like a puzzle. Alright. I don't remember this. Oh, come on, really? We did it. Killer. Ooh! Speaking of killer. Rare ring. Increases the appearance rate of rare items. Defense down two, luck up five. Ah, that's good. That's good. These are all good rings. I'll take the defense drop just to get that increase for drop rate. Beam Scout might be better just because it uses way less uh, MP. Okay, I see the gimmick here. Demon restores MP as damage is inflicted upon him. Hmm. Balmung. Legendary Sword of the Dragon Slayers. Worse than the Ascalon. Oh, but this. Oh, it's a straightforward attack. So the Burt Gong. Is not as good. Alright, so we got a replacement for the Burt Gong. Or the Burt Gang. That 
said, this is very unwieldy. It's very slow. We had an unexpected Discord call. What happened? Dead phone situation. Oh. At least they were nice enough to check up on you. Lubricant. Oh my god, these guys are fucking me up. Oh, you were just hanging out with them earlier today. sure there's a different way to do this, but I don't know how. Oh, fuck, no. It, uh, it's almost like it doesn't work after a certain point. Ulrox's suit. Armored suit once worn by Ulrox. Looks exactly the same as the pitch black suit, but hey, it gives me a boost to everything. Ooh, that's good. Except for intelligence, but it's only a one point drop, so whatever. So I got all the stuff there. Bomb Mung, Ulrox's suit, and the rear ring. Kill me. Oh, 
Oh, your phone was actually dead? Well, it's like how my phone, I would try to replace the battery and I accidentally ex made it explode inside the phone. And I'm still able to fix it afterwards. Whew. Alright, I'm gonna do the boss and that's probably gonna be it for the stream. Except not really. Lore packs a deadly punch. Wow. I'm getting really lucky with the boss souls. Hundred and twenty MP per use. That's pretty cool. Though I can imagine that is extremely situational. New ability. Giant bat transforms into a bat that gives you the ability to fly. Uh, yeah, I figured it was gonna be an L button or an R button. You cannot use that very long. Watch oh, Jay. Ugh. Jay, what's wrong? You look pale. Don't worry, just now. All my memories came flooding back. What? It seems that your dark power triggered the return of my memories. Just like I guessed, I have quite an extensive history with Dracula. I thought so. My real name is Julius Belmont. I am a descendant of the clan that has fought against Dracula for ages. And the person who destroyed Dracula in 1999 was... Yes, it was me, but there were others who assisted me. So if Dracula is revived again, just as is written in the prophecy, then I must destroy him. It is my destiny. You haven't met a man named Graham yet, have you? I hear a noise outside. Oh, you haven't met a man named Graham yet, have you? Graham, you mean that missionary, right? I met him a little while ago, but when he saw my face, he turned and ran. He told me that he was Dracula. I did sense Dracula's powers within him. Yeah, there's something going on outside. But it's difficult to believe that he's Dracula. Rather, I think... No, forget it. It's nothing more than a hunch. Huh? Assuming that he is Dracula, I won't be able to kill him yet. Why not? I need my weapon. Your weapon? Yes. It's a whip that was handed down to me. It's called the Vampire Killer. In 1999, I sealed it in this castle to weaken his spirit and magical powers. That means it's in this castle somewhere? Yes, and I know exactly where it is. I'll go and get it now. Alright, please be careful. Pray that my hunch proves to be wrong. Farewell for now.
Whew. That's where I'm gonna stop for now. So let's see. I can still go up here. I haven't explored the top part of the arena yet. Uh, I can explore anywhere that I need to fly. So those two blackened areas on the main map. As well as that room that's missing chunks of it. I can explore those. I could probably go up from that room that I couldn't get to before. We'll see, though. We shall see. Double saves to be safe. Alright, let's see. Before I go, do I want to host anyone? The answer is... Not really? No. I mean, I, there's someone on here I could host, but it's, there's no, not really much point. <laughs> so yeah, uh, that's it for this week, obviously. Week's over. Next week, I could go back to two a week. Uh, more of this. Probably This will probably be another week. Another stream of this, and then a stream of the Julius mode. And then I'll move on to Parasite Eve 2, and that'll be the stream until hopefully November. But yeah, uh, thanks for coming. Always appreciate it. Have a great evening, and I will see you all next week. Good night.